Hi everyone, Michael Brown back again. Welcome back to Educator.com's Adobe Photoshop Elements Beginning and Intermediate Course. We've talked about quality, we've talked about light, now it's time to get down to the nuts and bolts of how to work in Photoshop Elements. And if you remember, Elements has two parts, Organizer, which is the editing and sorting program, and Editor, which is the enhancing and working program. Right now, this is the editor workspace where we have my uh, lesson files. To get back and forth from editor to organizer and back at the bottom of the workspace and editor, here's the organizer button. Click that. Here's organizer. And to get from organizer to editor, same thing. Click the editor button. In this lesson, we're going to talk about the organizer making it easy. The objective of this course is to get you up and running in Photoshop Elements quickly and easily. In that context, the organizer has several different ways to organize your images, but I'm only going to show you the easiest ways to import, sort, rate, edit, and find your best images because what we want to do here, rather than go over every single feature inside of Photoshop Elements, we want to get your images from the camera, from the card reader, from somewhere that you have them on the computer, and get them into Organizer. Let me get this thing right here. To get those images into Organizer, to organize them for easy access, to sort them quickly and easily, so that we can identify the best images, and get those images on into the editor and enhance them. So in this lesson, we're going to talk about the Organizer, importing and sorting. There'll be a couple of more lessons on Organizer, but we're going to start here with importing and sorting. The first thing I want to mention is getting organized. Have a plan and stick to it. What I mean by that is put your images where you know where they are and that you're not going to have to move them because the original files, wherever they reside, that's where Organizer knows they are. What I mean by that is all these thumbnails from all of these images that I have inside of Organizer are not the original images. What Organizer has done for all of these folders and all of these albums, it has connected a thumbnail that it created from the original to the original. So when you open this file in Editor, it's not opening this particular exact file you're looking at. It's going to open the original that the thumbnail is connected to. So if you move the file or you rename the file, Organizer will no longer know where it is or what it is. So the point is, be consistent, have a plan, Have a plan and stick to that plan, okay? Very important. We'll keep revisiting this as we go on. 